I love Winnipeg. Winnipeg's home for me. Uh, I love everything the city has to offer. I think the people here are great. Uh, everything about Winnipeg is awesome. Name is Abi Khan, the restaurant is Shorma Khan, and I am the Wrath of Khan. So the inception story of Shorma Khan in this location is actually pretty funny. I was slated to go in across the street and at the 11th hour, somehow they pulled the lease out from under me because they said they didn't want garlic smell in the building. That same day, we're driving down McDermott here. And this place here has tape on the windows and there's a little handwritten sign on paper that says four lease. No bathroom, metal gates on all the windows. The top windows were boarded in because people had thrown rocks in here before. The front door was boarded up and it turned out to be the greatest rejection I could ever have in my life. One of those couple sales guys came in here to talk to us about skip the dishes and I said, you gotta do the dishes for me? We're, we're relying on this income that's coming in from sales that we would not have had without skip the dishes. It, it doesn't affect our customer experience in the store. The way customers are changing and buying is the future. It's gonna to continue to go that way while we don't have the delivery drivers. Let's get someone else to do it, and it's a win-win. Did you grow up cooking? I hate cooking. That's why I opened a restaurant too, is I don't wanna cook, I don't like cooking. I can cook eggs, pasta, pizza for my kid, cereal. I am gonna be making the spit uh, just for you guys. Uh, I haven't made these in five years. <laughs> what are we supposed to do first? <laughs> am I doing this right? So basically it's just, we just stack it on. Uh, when I retired from playing football, I wanted to be the boss. I wanted to be in charge of my own destiny. And I ultimately landed on Shoma Khan because I figured that uh, I saw there's a huge need for fresh food. So I played in the uh, Grey Cup in 2012, end of November. Uh, came back to Winnipeg. My son was born January 3rd. Uh, and then the restaurant opened two and a half weeks after that. Do you see what he's actually doing? Every piece I put on, he's taking off and fixing. God, this is heavy. How do you do this every day? All right, spit is on. It's not bad. So even this morning, my kid goes, Dad, why are you wearing the hat? You haven't worn the hat in a long time. And I go, well, kid, I'm doing a video for Skip the Dishes. He goes, can we order clay oven tonight? <laughs> <laughs> my parents came over in 79, uh, and I think the catalyst for change was just to give their kids a better life. Canada allowed us the opportunity to come here, my family as immigrants, and, and settle and be successful in giving the tools and skills to grow. I was allowed to grow, exposed to football. The more diverse we are, the stronger we are together. And, and, and Shorma Khan's a little, uh, little Middle East example of that, I guess. Right? We have guys from Pakistan, India, Tunisia, we have Palestine. We have a couple refugees that are with us, and they're now head chefs at my restaurant. Uh, this guy here works in Syria at a Shorma shop. I love anyone from Australia. If anyone from Australia is looking for a job, we're hiring.